Ruth's in Windsor. Morning, Ruth. Oh, good morning, Andrew. And who are you going to be thinking about at 11 today? Well, I've got so much to say about this subject. I'm a forces child, so I've always been brought up with a deep respect for people who lost their lives for our freedom. And you only have to stop and think for a second about Afghanistan, and we should be continually grateful for that. Just listening to you then, I remember growing up talking to one of my dad's friends who flew one of the Lancaster bombers and in lots of raids. And talking to him, even as a child, he had a tear in his eye talking about it because of the camaraderie, because of the trust. Um, it was such an intense time and he felt they probably were the best days of his life even though he, you know, he could have died at any moment. Um, yes, that's, that's, that rings true from anyone, I think, who's served in the military and during the Second World War. You very often get the sense that these were the best days, don't you? Yes. Yeah, I mean, it's sometimes like, you know, people always say school days are the best days of their life, not necessarily for me, but really it's that intensity of growing up. And, and I think the trust you have with your men or women serving has to be phenomenal doesn't it because lives are at stake so yeah amazing amazing time of human connection um i just also wanted to talk a little bit about castle view because as you know i I work in a retirement village in a very close community yeah and a lot of their husbands and fathers served in the war but i also think going back to your previous caller we have such a deep respect for grief so you can imagine if you counted all the years up of life experience staff and our apartment owners alike we've lost children mothers partners husbands wives and we stand together so we will be standing together at 11 o'clock this morning and on sunday we do a big remembrance thing on sunday um last year because of lockdown people couldn't go to their usual services and we have a retired catholic father mike morrissey is very well known around windsor um we pulled him out of retirement to do a short service and we all stood together um it was very evocative and then we had a very quiet muted lunch afterwards but the the respect is palpable yeah. when you stand together in silence all remembering our loved ones and we're all touched by it hope it goes well later ruth thank you very much that's ruth in windsor